We're broadcasting live from the Dirty South Dome in Atlanta, Georgia, where the living's easy and the sushi is called bait. I thought you said her name was Susie. Yeah, but you're right, she did look a little older. Fifteen at least. Both teams hit the field ready to hit each other in this NFL matchup. The Purple Mutant Eaters go up against the Atlanta Vultures. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hey, man, you see that? That's right. You can't handle this. You can't handle what I got. Yeah, get the hell out of here, man. The panty wagons in the parking lots are full. The familiar scent of bodily fluids in the air. And the men's room is both flooding and on fire. And that means MFL game day is on the air. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzer along with Bricks and Bricks Jr. And last week, some mutant let out a lava blast in one of the stalls in the men's room. Place went up like an oil rig. Flames and explosions. Water shooting out of where the toilets were. <laughs> I electrocuted myself using the electric hand dryer. I wish they had paper towels at least as an option. Oh, and that one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. <laughs> Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Normally, that would be a first down, but he had a whole lot of ground to make up. Third down, and the punter is warming up. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Oh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. It sounds like my offseason. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot, hot one. He just picked the receiver's pocket, and the defense gets a turnover. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. <laughs> and it's first and ten. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. And it's first and ten. And that's another turnover for the defense. Oh, with the brutal hit. And it's first and ten. Nine, one, nine. He zings it in there for a four yard gain. Second down and six. Hot. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Whenever a player gets big like this, it reminds me of that Tom Hanks movie. At this point, with multiple interceptions, he, oh, he took a leap and had the ball knocked out. Fumble! He's got a case of fumble on Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. And 
And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. And that's right. Boom, dead and down. Nothing more to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy. Ah, uh, well, he was a violent alcoholic, a terrible father, and uh, he did some nasty things to dogs. <clears throat> but, uh, I mean, he was a great ball player. Uh, you know, that's really what counts at the end of the day, right? And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, eight. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. And it's first and ten. Hot, eight. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of... And whoever said never hit a man when he's down is just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. First down and nine. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot eight. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. Straight through the uprights. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And it's first and ten. Boom! Second down and two. And a hard run there picks up the first down. And the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. Nice pass. That catch is good for six yards. Third down and six. the way your wife hits the all-you-can-eat buffet of crab apple trees, Bricks. Ah, uh, you're telling me. She ate 47 Salisbury steaks one time. Thought she had food poisoning. Turns out her low intestines just exploded. Oh, that's a relief, because there's nothing worse than food poisoning. Oh, uh, you're telling me. Oh, he just got crushed. Second down and ten. for a nine-yard completion. They are moving the ball now. The ref calls a penalty. You know, the MFL has eliminated almost every penalty in the rule book, and yet it still feels like there's way too many penalties. Stupid jerks. You guys suck. Third down, and, well, good luck. 
guys are not giving the quarterback many passing lanes. Oh, man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore grin. And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is a palm print. That cross-stitching, unbelievable. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. You can't keep a good mutant. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. Nice pickup for six yards. And that'll be second down and four. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. Boom to the moon! Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. All you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about? And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Ooh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. Second down and five. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 Freud rage. How do you like your brain? Scrambled or fried? What great play by the defense. It's not too often a court. There's a bloody red head on the field. No, that's their red penalty marker, Briggs. Looks like this one's coming back. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the NFL. <laughs> that's the end of the first quarter, and it's still anyone's game. And it's first and ten. Second down and nine. Oh, the defender almost picked off the ball on that one. Third down and nine. left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. And he put all of his foot into that one. Nice catch. And he Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. And it's first and ten. And he picks up eight yards on a strong run. Bingo! Bingo! I just hit that mutant bingo! And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays! Talk about luck! Second down and two. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Defense gets another pick. Man, and like a monkey trying to fuck a grease football, he gets away in a... Oh, with the brain scrambler. <laughs> and it's first and ten. 
for the extra point. It's good. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. And he punched his way out of that tackle. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. The fuck? It is such bullshit. This game is fucking rigged. I tell you, the programmers are speeding up the defense. I'm going to write an email to that fucker. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, eight. Second down and long. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And the bomb goes off, hurting no one. Yeah, if a bomb don't kill anyone, does it still make a sound? Third down and long. Hot, hot one, hot two. Another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned. Oh, devastating hit. You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Her grade. She's the Mary Margaret of our ladies of holy hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. And it's first and ten. Rage. Because if you can't answer your defense in the the defense calls the thunderclap dirty trick. Man, that's gotta hurt. Don't make the hair on your corpse stand straight up. The coach isn't liking that call. Oh, oh his head just exploded. Play miss, play miss. Oh, First and goal. The defense had enough with this ref and jumps off sides to kill him. <laughs> and there goes the ref. You know, Bricks, it's a tough job for a ref to control an angry, fired-up gang of mutants. Kind of like asking a zebra to serve tofu kebabs to a pack of starving lions in the Serengeti. You know, Grim, I killed a ref in Rio once. Eh, just to watch him die. And it's first and ten. <laughs> Running game is starting to click now. A pickup of eight on the play. Second down and two. And that'll bring up third down and seven. catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. <laughs> and it's first and ten.
Second down in a very lot. Two minutes remain in the half. Wait! I gotta take a dump! Again? You just went. How is that even possible? Ah, it's the nachos, man! Want some? Oh, man! Bricks, you gotta love a player who goes down fighting. The offense is down to their last running back. If they lose him, they lose all their running plays. Third down, and the punter is warming up. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. And the defense quickly calls a timeout. They want to get the ball back. I want Sean Kicka make a kick like this with his extra leg. He used it like a golf club. That wasn't a leg, you moron. That was Tripod Jenkins. He's got the distance, and the kick is good! When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot. Looks like a pass, and it's bouncing right back to the QB. Oh, it's the sticky ball dirty trick. Ah, oh, pass the popcorn, Grim. Zoom in on his face, then his crotch. I'm going to see if he cries or pisses himself first. What the hell an old fellow. Second down in a lot. Hot, hot one. was steering a pick six but dropped the interception. And it plays a defense, schmuck. Third down and, well, good luck. Hot, hot one, hot. Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I don't... Oh, you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon rabies blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. And the hurry-up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. Oh, great play by the defense. The receiver didn't stand a chance. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! How have they not killed him yet? He's wearing a new mink coat, for God's sake. He's seven layers of smarmy, Grim. Second down and more. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. Yeah. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. run right there, Bricks. They shot. And that's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. The quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Aren't we all, Grim? Aren't we all? Oh, he just got crushed. Ah, oh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so are the fans. 
First down and nine. And he takes a timeout here. They have two left. I wonder if he has a plan. Well, maybe he's just going to take the teeth out of the back of his neck that have been stuck there since the opening play. And the defense gets another pick. Man, rough day. Hey, Pam, what a interception. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. That yeah, was probably all the diarrhea. Oh, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed everyone who came to Mexico forever to crack their pants. Uh, sounds like he didn't really think it through because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but they're not the guests. What the fuck are you talking about? Uh, I don't really know right now. What day is it? And he held on to that one for a first down. Oh, man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the rep didn't see it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. It's a close battle as the quarter ends. Halftime is brought to you by those caring folks at Monsatan Industries. They make the world a better place by making the government tell you it is. We're at the start of the third quarter in a nail-biter. The teams line up for the second half kickoff. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. jailbreak and the defense jumps offside to kill the ref oh crowd's loving it and it's first and ten and he was stuck to him like glue Second down and ten. Hot, hot one. Hot. He broke free and has open field in front of him. Someone better buy this guy dinner tonight because he just saved a touch. Oh, man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Yeah. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore grin. First and four. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. And the crowd goes wild. Touchdown, touchdown. Now there are 
are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. And he breaks away! First and ten. At this rate, the QB is going to have more interceptions than come. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well placed cleat. And it's first and ten. And that's another turnover for the defense. Oh, what a brutal hit. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Second down in a mile. And there's an eight-yard catch. Chipping away with those medium passes, I like it. Like a patient prison break. Third down and long. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. The offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, Wim, they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. Uh, that's the funeral expenses, that is. And it's first and ten. Just saved a touchdown on that deflection. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. Oh, great throw, great catch, and that puts six points on the board. The defense can do anything to stop a throw that good, man. You mean aside from priming the ref, kill the quarterback? Playing some D. <laughs> Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. And that's another pick. Man, oh, man, the defense is going to have more receptions than the offense. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot With another pick, the QB says, I don't know how much 
throw interceptions, but he could go all the way. Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, uh, going in circles. First and ten. Ah, another interception. Geez, you give this guy a bigger pink. How? And how about a little dirt sandwich? First and ten. Nine. Nine. One. I personally think that the ginormous guy is compensating for something. The quarterback busts up the ginormous play before it could even get started by tossing the ball out of bounds. Someone get that QB a cold one, huh? First down in a mile. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Defense gets another pick. Man, rough day. Hey, Chris, what a interception. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And it's first and ten. I've had it. I'm running out of excuses for this QB. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And that's the kind of play you pay the secondary for. You pay it for the pick six. For this, you just give them a pat on the head and tell them they don't suck. Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 He is. He broke free and has open field in front of him. Oh, man. His neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Oh, uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with, uh, no mustard? And it's first and ten. for an easy kill. Second down and ten. His cleats are caked in blood and guts and he's looking to score. And then Cats will give them a first down with the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwong Galaxy phone. And it's first and ten. A mix of tiger blood, shark blood, and internet comments. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. So was that cheerleader. Second down and ten. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team. A man from prison just came out of the field. It's the ref, idiot. Oh. Let's see what the penalty is.
First down and forever. Talk about Butterfingers. He should have had that one. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. And into the end zone for a touchdown! Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. Oh, no, that was totally unnecessary. <laughs> I got to see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. I hope they have raincoats in the front row because that was splattering everywhere. It's first and ten. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. And whoever said never hit a man when he's down is just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. Second down and long. And that brings us to the end of the third quarter. They'll need to fire on all cylinders to make a comeback in the final quarter. Second down in a very lot. warming up. Great play by the defense. It's not too often a quarterback gets projected. That's why that's the position I originally tried out for. I want to know what it's like for other people to accept you. Now that went from a joke to making me feel feelings. Stop it. This roid rage dirty trick transforms a player into a rampage. Some kid in his bed wearing nothing but underwear made a really stupid call right there, Bricks. First and ten. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. I do. The guy should have fucking caught it. They could not connect on that play. And they'll line up for the punt here. Nice 
Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. No return on this punt. The defense will just down it. I can't tell if he's smart or scared. Either way, the ball is down. And it's first and ten. At this point, with multiple interceptions, the QB... Oh, with a punishing hit. Since when is that a penalty? Uh, since now, I guess, Grim. First down and inches. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. And it's first and ten. He refuses to go down, and he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jet, you son of a bitch! Whoa, hold everything. Looks like there's a penalty on the play. First and four. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. Well, why go for one when you can go for two? It's always been my philosophy, but Bricks can't even get one. Oh, you're talking about points. <laughs> forward for the two-point conversion. This is so hard to watch. These guys with the repeat brain injuries, I know how it is. I feel bad for them. What are you talking about? He's just dancing. That's a normal human who is dancing. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. First and ten. He's going long with the pass. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. point attempt. It's good. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. First and ten. Oh, what a punishing hit that. Oh, mama. Just call him Cap and Crunch. Another one bites the dust. First and ten. And another interception. This quarterback is going to listen to... Oh, great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, and that's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. And it's first and ten. Get 
runs in there and swats the ball away. He can't kick, but he sure can swat. Second down and ten. Nicely done for a first down. And it's first and ten. Six yard game there. That's a solid pickup. I wish people would do Stingo. Stingo. I just hit that mutant bingo. And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays. Talk about luck. And that'll be second down and four. That's a killer. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Ah, oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league. Third and four. And he stayed with the receiver and deflected the ball. And kickers practice for this kind of kick every day. Pretty standard. Nothing standard when you got bloodthirsty mutants on the defensive line. The kick is good. Eh, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably grabbed his pants. And it's first and ten. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! And they line up for the extra point. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. Is he proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. Their marketing team hates it. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. And that pass play is good for eight yards. Second down and two. And they just popped his eyes in the back of his head. That quarterback can be hurting or dead. <laughs> Third down and, well, good luck. And he just, at this rate, the QB's going to have more interceptions than completions. And he just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? And he's running like a moose right now. And that is caught for a first down. Oh, mama. Just call him Cap and Crunch. Another one bites the dust. Offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, same as Britch's ex girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called it rabbit sex. I took it as a compliment. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. Oh, he just got 
crushed. And it's first and ten. force meets the explodable object. Oh, and they got him. That's a touchdown saving tackle. Seriously, man, you think you'll go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? You get my grill, I'll ruin your world. Ruin it. The offense is down to their final receiver. They'll be playing shorthanded for the rest of the game. Uh, and if they lose him, will they have to forfeit? Uh, talk about pressure. I'm going to have to take the before this one ends. Hey, y'all been out on me. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as that. He had it for a second there. And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense calls plays at the line of scrimmage and plays really fast. Why would they do that? And then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least. And they take their first time out. Uh, how predictable. Surprise us next time. Call the timeout during halftime. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry-up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry-up, too? Grim, can I kill him? And the passing game picking up some steam, a gain of seven there. Second and three. The QB saves some clock by calling a timeout. They have one left. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. The quarterback burns his last time out. They can't stop the clock anymore. And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. And the MFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 90.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Crap! The offense is down to their last two receivers. Once they're gone, it's game over, baby. Ah, those poor receivers. They're really getting a snot kicked on them. Someone ought to just shoot them, put them out of their misery. Uh, don't worry, that's coming. And it's first and ten. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. What you talking about? The Vultures walk away victorious today. It was total and complete and utter domination. And speaking of domination, look at the stilettos on that cheerleader. Uh, I'd let her walk on my back. I'll tell you what, I'll pay her to do a river dance on your back with golf shoes. And let's go to the MVP to hear him let loose with some verbal diarrhea about just how special he is. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.